Hello all, this is a new series about my adventures of creating an endless driving video game. I'm still in the early stages with my co-lead, The Kind Kitten, but far enough along that I want to share my progress. But first off, what is the game hit? Duck Out Drive, the real name pending, is a florid, never-ending highway roaming game where you hijack to jump between vehicles at high speeds as you explore a graphic, whimsical world. It aims to focus on the fun of driving and world exploration, and less on the conventional racing game mechanics. It's more about discovering and finding new cars and uncovering locations as opposed to unlocking levels and vehicles. Over the course of the next few videos, I'm planning to share my exploration of vehicle physics in different game engines, then how I tackled procedural road generation, and then following that, my approach for creating functional car and traffic AI. Uh, there's definitely going to be more topics after that one. One thing I do want to call out is I'm being very intentional about this project so it doesn't fizzle out or become too grand to ever release. You often hear in devlogs how projects get too large or teams have to constantly restart to get things right and it's very taxing emotionally. I also know from prior experience that it's really tempting to spend more of your time tweaking parameters to get just the perfect vehicle physics rather than making the larger scale progress if you don't set clear goals. Thus, early on, I made this simple plan for development broken into concepts. What that means is I'm more working on individual standalone projects to grow my experiences rather than jumping directly into building the final game. In fact, between each demo, I plan to literally scrap everything. This also gives me the space to freely test out mechanics without locking myself into a structure if I realize later that something isn't working out just the right way. As such, I am planning to release the different gameplay demos as standalone projects before the real work begins on the actual game. So, of course, don't treat any of this as final graphics, model styles, or really anything. It's just a stepping stone. Once again, big kudos to the kind kid who nudged me to restart this product idea from years ago and is now a co-lead. He's been great about testing builds and updates on a weekly basis and helping come up with creative ideas for the game. I'm definitely looking forward to the stage where more of you can test the demo concepts, but until that point, you can follow the project here. Links are in the description, or I'll also be posting snippets here and there on Twitter and so forth. Until next time, all.